All right, hello and welcome to another MMS, uh, not a speaker interview, but also not a sponsor interview. Today I'm actually joined by Nash. You know, Nash, uh, you're involved kind of on the management side, a little bit behind the scenes of MMS. So why don't you just quickly introduce yourself and then we'll kind of get to our topic of the day. Well, hi, I'm Nash Fearson and I'm with the MMS Conference Committee. I also happen to be a speaker and a sponsor. Uh, but I am a member of the Minnesota System Center User Group, which is puts on the Midwest Management Summit. That's right. So before we get into our special topic of the night, why don't you tell us a little bit about, you know, why, why is MMS special? So yeah, MMS basically came out of the community. Uh, community leaders wanted to see a conference where we had excellent technical content uh, that went very deep and was presented by real world experts. And the only way we thought we were going to get that is if we did it ourselves. And so we gave it a shot last year. It was a resounding success. We're going bigger and better this year. That's right. You know, uh, I, we were both there last year. It sounded like everyone had a great time over there at the conference. It was, it was one of the first conferences for me in recent memory where people, they said, oh, it's not as good as last year. Like every conference I've been to in the last few years, it's been exactly like that. And this was one conference that people were actually having a really good time. They were pretty excited about what was going on. So Nash, we get one question all the time. And this is the, this is the whole reason why we're recording this video. And MMS has, we call it stacked sessions. So it's not just like you have uh, three sessions in one slot and then the next slot you have your next three sessions. You actually have some overlap. So it's a it can be a little bit difficult for people planning their sessions and a little bit difficult for speakers too. So why don't you tell us why, you know, why did we actually kind of overlap? We stacked our sessions up. Why don't you tell us about that? Well, there is some method to the madness. Um, we did this very intentionally where for each session, um, you get a full 60 minute block of session content where, you know, it's your typical, here's your demo, your slide deck, all of that stuff presented usually by an MVP or somebody from the product team. Um, but after that, you've got a 45 minute question and answer community discussion time that's led by that presenter. So you have a very long period of time. You've got over an hour and a half in that room if you want to. The trick to all of this is that with stacking it, we give everyone the option to either stay for the 60 minutes of technical content and then go fit in another session or go even deeper and get all of your questions answered and go talk to the person who's an, you know, usually the world's best expert on that topic. It presents people with a problem though. They've got to go and make a values decision with their time. I can either go incredibly deep on a subject or double the number of sessions I'm going to get into, uh, maximize depth or maximize breadth. It's up to you. Yeah, I, I want to say the stacked sessions. It's the one thing that keeps coming up and coming up, and sometimes the speakers don't like it. Sometimes the, some of the attendees might have questions about it. But at the end of the day, it's really to maximize the value to attendees and to really just give the attendees you know, as many options as they could possibly have. Um, what, what we saw last year overwhelmingly is that it was confusing going into it, but once people got the hang and, uh, of it and understood what it was there for, that extra 45 minutes of Q&A and discussion is where a lot of the value actually came out of it because you've got all the other people in the room who are interested in the same topic, uh, who have the same questions and the same concerns, and you get the point of view of that speaker and the entire community in there with you. Um, for the every session I did last year, we had 10, 20, 30 people in the room till the very end of that birds of a feather, 45 minutes at the end. All right. Well, I think uh, I think we got the point across. I think if you know if there's any questions about why we do that, I think we've answered it here, and I think uh, I think that's about that will do it for us tonight. Thanks, Lee. Thanks, Dash. And thank you, Ed. Is this thing on? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Perfect.